by Doris Burke, Craig Anthony, and David Aldridge reporting courtside. Now, a look at Dallas's starting lineup. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. Daniel Gafford is out there with P.J. Washington. And it's Thompson in at the small forward. And for Los Angeles, down in the block, it'll be Kawhi next to Zubac. Then it's Harden. Then there's Derek Jones. And it's Mann in at the shooting guard position. So many teams, Greg, look to run these days. It's refreshing, isn't it, to see a battle between half-court offenses? And to excel at that. You, you have to be extremely tactical, minimize turnovers, and execution is key. Now, here's Gafford. Thompson finds Washington. Six to shoot. Here's the three. Kawhi Leonard comes up with the rebound. The pass to Harden. Let's it go from deep. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. This is James Harden deep in his bag. Off the dribble drive. Put that defender in the rear view, James. And Doncic gets it to go. Boy, that one was not easy. Every once in a while, you just make a tough shot. About one minute into the first quarter. Kicks it out to Harden. For the three. And again, it's the Clippers from deep. Now, Kawhi Leonard understands when and where to deliver the ball to his teammates. Pretty play. Thompson outside. Pass to Washington. And the rejection by Zubats. Harden inside the three-point line. The Mavericks pull it in. Well, if the defense gives him that shot next time, they could get burned. I think he's just a little bit out of rhythm. It's good. This guy can do so much for you on the offensive end, and that is why his number gets called time and time again. Here's Leonard. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And over the years, we have seen Kawhi Leonard continue Doris to battle through injuries. Kevin, he has been a hot topic as it relates to that loaded word, load management. But we have to be fair. Kawhi has had a number of leg and knee issues. There is a certain amount of caution you want to take where his body is concerned. Shooting two. That free throw good from Leonard. And Doris, the Clippers are moving into a new arena in Inglewood in 2024. And Kevin, I think this is absolutely huge for the organization. Part of establishing your own identity in Los Angeles will be their new arena. So exciting for this fan base that's growing and growing. Leonard hits them both. Doris, when we look at the Dallas Mavericks, it looks like a team that has shown they want to win now. Kevin, I think their ownership has never been afraid to pull the trigger on a big trade. The Mavs are not about just making it to the playoffs. This is an organization that seeks the ultimate prize, and that is to win an NBA championship. Now, here is Harden. Six points for him, and it's good. Two points. You see, in pick-and-roll action, this is where the intellect, the feel, the craftiness, the mastery of James Harden is all on display. Here's Irving. Doncic looking it over. Misses the deep three-point attempt. Los Angeles leading by six. Leonard kicks to Harden. Passes it to Mann. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. Washington against Leonard. And the rejection by Gafford. Doncic dishes to Irving. Harden against Thompson. Pass to Doncic. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's on Kawhi Leonard. 
What an up fake by Luka Doncic. He got the that Dodgers. defender quickly Luka off the screen. Dodgers. Now let's shoot in their first free throws. First trip to the line in this one. And going back a season ago, they were a pretty average team at the line, about 76% altogether. That free throw good from Doncic. The 2023 season, DB, had a bitter end for the Clippers in the first round of the playoffs. Now, Kevin, it is always difficult when the primary storyline for your team in a season is the injuries and the unavailability of your players. That is what cost the Clippers in the end. All three throws good from Doncic. Well, Doris, some question, as you know, the move that Dallas made last season acquiring Kyrie Irving. They gave up a lot, for sure. Boy, they sure did, Kevin, and it was a high-risk move that obviously fell flat. And for this organization, it has been trying to get the right mix around Luka Doncic. That is the key for them to succeed. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Thompson outside. There's the pass to Gafford. Back to Thompson. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. I'll tell you, most of the time, this guy's going to finish that. But that was tremendous defense that prohibits him from completing the play. And that's on a bounds. Dallas will retain possession. <laughs> Clippers on defense. Out to Doncic. Back to Thompson. A three ball. Craps in the tray. The speed with which Clay Thompson gets to his shooting motion off the catch makes him as dangerous as anyone. Harden the pass to Zubats. Here's Mann. Still yet to score. Here's Leonard. It's good. It's his second basket. Shooting two for four. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. Trailing by five. Thompson outside. Launches it. Hits the three-point bomb. Thompson's got six. Well, this is his prototypical shot. Clay Thompson from three. Pass to man. Kicks it out to Jones. Harden outside. Clock at four. Rejection by Gafford. And here is Doncic. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. And what you love about his work defensively, the ability to challenge and change shots without fouling. Here's Irving. James Harden picking up that last basket. Washington finds Irving. And good that time. Well, this is one of the best in the league at converting off contact. What body control by Kyrie Irving. Man passes to Zubac. Here's Man. Harden outside. The three. Who's back up? Leonard, the pass to Zubac. And that one, good. So strong, so tough. He beats the Zubac, absorbs the contact, and goes right through it. Doncic outside. Back to Irving. 
and looks that's like green. the illegal green. pick was set. Green. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. Ball. Beyond the lean, so you can see his ball. feet weren't set Norman on ball. that screen. Easy call. You know, he's just leaning a little bit. You try to get away with it, but boy, the official all over it. Powell, he's jacked in for Los Angeles. Kevin Porter comes in for man. Now, here's Leonard. He's got six. The kick out to Porter. Pass to Harden. Driving to the basket. And the rejection by Gafford. Dallas basketball. Mavericks trailed by four. Now, here's Washington. Back to Doncic. Pass to Washington. On the wing, Irving. Guarded by Porter. A nice shot by Irving. This is Kyrie Irving at his absolute best. The shot making under duress is special. And the Clippers decide to take their first time out here. And part of the show tonight, Doris, Kyrie Irving's phenomenal handle. And hey, Kevin, if you ask any NBA player who their favorite to watch is, many will come up with the name Kyrie Irving. It's the ability to have that elite handle, the footwork, the creativity, the ability to shoot a jumper, the pull-up, the lay-in. This guy is absolutely amazing. Here's Zubats following the basket by Kyrie Irving. And they call an illegal screen here. First personal foul. The Mavericks trailer. Here's Grimes. Thompson for the triple. They get the rebound. Doncic. The shot goes down and it gets this game back to even. Doncic has got six. Uh, all the ways Luka Doncic can score. If he gets to the offensive window, look out. Zubac kicks to Powell. Good for the basket. No, Starting no, no, no. off one for one with that shot. And the Mavericks with possession here. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. And it's out of bounds. Nice touch by Doncic. Yeah, I think he was surprised to see that pass coming his way and just really reacted too late. And so it's Porter bringing it up now for the Los Angeles Clippers. And there's the pass to Powell. Good, and a nice assist from Porter. Powell's got his second basket of the game. Well, on the catch and shoot, Norman Powell ready to rise and fire. Pass to Thompson. Back to Doncic. And here's Thompson. Shot clock at six. Leonard with the steal. Now the Clippers moving it up. On up the court. Harden, no good. Mavericks trailed by five. Thompson outside. Takes the three. The rebound by Harden. In the corner, Powell with it. Harden surveying the D. It's rebounded by Dallas. Here's Lively. Nothing on the board. Misses that one. He's 0 for 1 from the floor. Passes to Harden. Leonard on the wing. Outside Porter. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. Six on the shot clock. And here's Harden for three. Los Angeles with a fresh shot clock. Yeah, Zufats knows his job, and that's to do the dirty work. Get into the offensive glass. Pass to Grimes. Now here's Doncic. To halt the run. You often hear the phrase franchise player. When you think about Luka Doncic and the amount he controls the action, the MVP level play, he is the true definition of it. 
And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Los Angeles. We've got a bunch of this game yet to be played, but they're shooting it well from the three-point line. That's got to be a welcome sight. I think the other thing they've done a great job of is making their presence felt inside, converting tons of pain opportunities. That free throw good from Doncic. And Los Angeles with some changes. Nicholas Batum, he's checked in for Kawhi Leonard. And Amir Coffey is subbed in for James Harden. The Mavericks also with a sub. Dinwiddie's checked in. All free throws good from Doncic. Clippers leading by five. Two minutes remaining in the first. Porter looking it over. Porter with the steal. And the dunk by the Zubac. And how about Porter Jr.'s court awareness? Excellent job finding the open man with the pass. Dallas has gotten just two of six to fall from three-point range so far in the first. Here's Doncic. It's held in by Zubac. Zubac has got four rebounds in this game. He kicks it to Porter. Back to Zubac. And Lively pulls it down. Mavericks trailed by seven. The pass to Kleba. Here's Grimes, guarded by Powell. Doncic outside. Pass to Grimes. Lock at six. And he gets the whistle for the three-second call. Don, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Coming onto the floor for your Clippers, Chris Dunn. Los Angeles leading by seven. Passes it to Zubac. Back to Dunn. Pass to Powell. Takes a three. That's in. Coming off an assist from Dunn. Powell's got eight points. They've been excellent so far. Coming in with a well-balanced attack. On the offensive end, it feels like they're getting the shots they want, and defensively, they are connected and on a string. Here's Coffey, still without a basket. That one doesn't go. Nice D from Doncic. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Dinwiddie outside. Kleba up top. Back to Dinwiddie. Six on the shot clock. Shoots the three. Kleba with the bucket. Maxi Kleba. Three-pointer. To the middle. Here's Zubats. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. And that concludes the first quarter of play. Los Angeles on top as they end the first quarter to the 14th of five runs. After this break, we'll be back at the start of the second quarter on 2K Sports. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. Guys, what's your take on the Clippers so far? Well, look at the turnover ratio, then look at the score. Easy to see what happened in that first period. Offensively, they took care of the ball, and defensively, they forced a number of miscues. Clippers leading by nine. So with Leonard on the bench, here's who Teron Lewis going with. They've got Ivica Zubats. Norman Powell is out there with Chris Dunn. Then there's Derek Jones. And it's Coffee in at the power forward. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. Irving kicks to Exum. Dinwiddie for three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Zubats has got six rebounds here tonight. And the pass to Dunn. Good ball movement here by the Clippers. Here's Coffey. Shot clock at five. The Clippers need to get off a shot. Three-pointer. A rebound by Washington. Mavericks trailed by 11. He dishes it to Irving. Just over a minute gone here in the second quarter. 
shoots from the high post, and he knocks down the jumper. Irving's got six points. And sports may be the ultimate meritocracy. Does it matter where you're from, a grade, your background? Uh, you got to have Dean, right? Kevin, it's a beautiful thing. Some players grew up with a father in the NBA. Others were a world away. Either way, when you get here, you know you've earned it. Coffee can't get it to go. The Maverick shooting, 43% for the game. Pass to Exum. Here he goes. And the rejection by Zubats. How about Zubats? Works so hard on the defensive end. Nicely done. It's Irving, top of the key. Shot clock at six. Shoots over Powell. How about the fast hands and lateral quickness of Norman Powell to get with his man and contest shots? That's good. Here's Coffee. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. That pass had to be thrown not only in the right spot, but at the right time. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Here's Lively. And the rejection by Zubats. On the wing, Jones. And Jones slams it in. There it is, guys. One of those effort plays that makes a big difference in the game. And GA, it is definitely making a difference so far today. That's great. No doubt. On the scoreboard, in the body language of the players, you can tell which team is in complete command. And it's Jones with the ball for the Los Angeles Clippers. This is the most they've led by, 13 points. Passes it to Dunn. Three-pointer. And Lively pulls it down. Lively's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Pass to Washington. Now Irving. Six points for him. And the rejection by Zubats. Now the pass to Coffey. Kicks to Dunn. Pass to Powell. Here's Coffey. Up to Powell. He's got eight. Here's Dunn. Kyrie Irving with the rebound. Average trailed by 13. Here's Washington. It's hauled in by Coffey. Well, we love his ability to attack the rim. He just loses a little bit of focus and misses the chippy. No question he got bumped on that shot. First personal foul. First team foul. The Clippers shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Amir Coffey to the line. Shot. No good on that one. Good on the second free throw. Irving with it. Six points for him. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. We all know Luka Doncic is a master of one-on-one -on -one isolation scoring. Coach Jason Kidd said he knows how to use his body in angles. Sometimes as a coach, you want to run all these plays, but at the end of the day, it's about getting him the ball with enough time to be creative. Kevin? DJ That's right, David. Letting him cook. Second Thanks for the report. Ball. And really the Second defense D fouling ball. there to the prevent the layup, but it's that's exactly what you need to do. The Clippers shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. 
And at the line last season, about 78% as a team. Pretty solid numbers. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one falls for Jones. James Harden, he's checked in for Chris Dunn. That one is no good. Average trailed by 15. Back to Dinwiddie. A score of the basket. Nice <laughs> shot after missing his first attempt. Just good aggressive drive from him that time. Found a hole in the D and went straight to the rim. Harden against Dinwiddie. Harden gets the bucket. Well, James Harden will go down as one of the great scorers in NBA history. And when he gets his groove going, look out, folks. Powell again turning. Driving in. And it's Exum in the corner. A three-pointer is Young right on target. Exum's got himself on the board with three there. This is as pure a shooter as there is. You've got to stay connected or it's a problem. Here's Harden. Up and in on the way. Well, James Harden has made a living out of tough shot making. And I'll tell you, the defense pretty good right there. James Harden just better. Passes it to Washington. And here's Exum. Into the lane. That's basket One number two down. with his third shot off to a fast two for three. Clippers leading by 12. Harden outside. Kept alive. Tries again. That one no good. Dallas has gone one or two on three pointers here in the second quarter so far. Lively the pass to Dinwiddie. Now here's Washington. Fires for three. That one drops and he's now two for five. I'll tell you, you are playing with fire any time you leave this guy open, and they just got burned. Harden up top. Dinwiddie covering. Harden can't hit. And it's Dinwiddie with the ball, bringing it up now for the Dallas Mavericks. Nine-point game. That's his third personal foul. First team. The Mavericks have been solid at the line so far. Line four for, for four. Mavericks. Lively. He misses the free throw. Big group substitution here for the Clippers. Bamba is checked in for Zubox. Batum comes in for Amir Coffey. Kawhi Leonard's checked in for Derek Jones. Mann subbed in for Powell. And then for Dallas. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Washington. Thompson comes in for Dante Exum. And Luka Doncic subbed in for Dinwiddie. No good at the strike this time. Second misses also. Los Angeles leading by nine. Here's Harden. He's off on that one. Great D that time from Irving. Doncic outside. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. Boy, and the foul. Doncic has got great upper body strength. Completes the play. Nicely done. He's had four chances at the line. Made them all. Free throw good from Doncic. 
Los Angeles has got nothing but zeros from long range in the second quarter. 0 of 4. Offensive struggles continue, missing again. Pass to Kleba. Fires top of the key. Rebound by the Clippers. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Here's Bamba. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. Well, obviously, this is where Mo Bamba is so dangerous. You make a mistake on the defensive end, he's going to take free throws. It's his first trip to the line. And that one falls for Bamba. Well, Mo Bamba is the prototypical modern NBA big, right? The size combined with the shooting ability. And so he's able to get one of two. Mavericks trailed by seven. And usually one of the league leaders in field goal percentage, Doris, Daniel Gamper. What a solid contributor. Kevin, you love those role players who play within themselves, and that's exactly what Gafford gives you, an understanding of what his team needs. Rim running, rim protection, and rebounding. Leonard finds Harden over Thompson, and Harden gets it to go in on the assist from Leonard. 16 points for James Harden. Versatile, a relentless James Harden, so tough to slow down. Jitch passes to Gaffer. Thompson for three. Another three for Dallas. You cannot leave him alone like that, especially from long range. Harden against Thompson. Kleba with the rebound. Mavericks trailed by four. Donchich outside. The pass to Grind. Now Kleba. Good job, side. Five on the clock. Dallas needs to get off a shot. They get it back. And Gafford throws it down. Good to see a player going all out when the game's this tight. You know, G.A., he knows what his job is. Patrol the offensive glass. And that's so demoralizing to your opponent. To play great defense and have the possession end that way, that's tough to take. All right, he is just so tough to guard. He can fake you one way and then use that beautiful spin to just blow by you. Pass to grind. No good from outside. Hard to figure out how he doesn't knock that one down. No defender in sight. Mavericks trailed by four. Thompson for the triple. Batum grabs the miss. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. And Leonard gets it to go. You see, Kawhi demands that you guard him physically. This guy's so powerful, sometimes it doesn't matter. Pass to Thompson. From past the arc. Good. And the assist Play goes to Doncic. Doncic has got three assists now in this one. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Here's Leonard. And the rejection by Gaffer. To the paint. Here's Kleba. No good. That's miss number two. He's one for three. Clippers leading by three. Harden outside, pass to man. Gafford against Leonard. Shot from the top of the key, and he gets the jumper to drop. Leonard's got 12 in the game. Well, what makes Kawhi so problematic in the pick and roll? He can do about anything he wants out of it, including keep the basketball. The pass to Kleba. Shoots over the two, and he wills that one in, sinking right through off the back iron. Boy, you cannot leave him alone like that. Good form on the fadeaway jumper. Leonard kicks to Batum. 
from the arc, and he's good on the three ball. Batum's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Average trailed by six. Pass to Gaff. Bamba with the block. I'll tell you the kind of lockdown defender Mo Bamba can be. Send it back, young man. The Mavericks have missed two free throws in the game, going five for seven. Two shots. First one falls. Gafford cans them both. 43 seconds left in the first half of the game. Here's Mann. He has yet to score. Bamba passes to Mann. Four on the clock. And here's Harden for three. And again, it's the Clippers from deep. I mean, we've come to expect this from James Harden. The ability to strike quickly from beyond the three-point line is just special. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Second personal foul. Fourth team foul. And it'll be his fourth time going to the free throw line in the game. And it's a super first half for him at the free throw line. Free throw good from Doncic. All free throws good from Doncic. And his work at the free throw line has been terrific tonight making the most of his chances now Leonard Batum for three and he was able to put it up in time but doesn't fall James Harden getting it done for Los Angeles he finishes with nine points in the quarter the D is having all sorts of problems with them and a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside David here with Ty Lu, good rhythm for your offense in the first half. What did you like about the start? Uh, moving the basketball, taking the right shot, making the right play. We make the extra pass, we're a tough team to beat. And you were sure tough in the first half, Coach. Thanks. Back to you. Thank you, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Greetings to each and every one of you watching at this very moment. Uh, I'm Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is here. Shaq is here. One half is behind us. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Right out of the gates, it was the Clippers setting the tone. You could see the daggers in their eyes as they went on a 10-4 run to start things off. Looking at the scoring breakdown, they ended up going wire to wire in the first quarter. Never once giving up their lead. Going through the second quarter, they started to look a bit fatigued, but played well enough to enjoy a five-point cushion here at the half. Kenny, what do you think about the Clippers? It's always a positive sign to see assist numbers like this. They're moving the rock with ease and keeping each other happy. It's a brand of unselfish basketball that we love to watch. And uh, Shaq, what did you see from Dallas? 
Well, I love that they were forceful at their offensive end. They got the shots they wanted. They played aggressively and got to the line. A strong attacking mindset. I like it. We'll see if they bring the same attitude in the second half, though. And that's going to do it for our halftime show, sadly. Third quarter about to start. See you again after the final. Horn. Oh, buzz. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. An exceptional performance so far from James Harden. And how about the amount he's contributing in the scoring column through two quarters? He has been terrific. And one would expect that the defense made some adjustments at halftime, but he has the ability to answer right back. Second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. Getting underway in the second half, here's the five for Jason Kidd. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. Washington out there with Thompson. And it's Gafford in at the five spot. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots of the game right here. Leonard for a free throw. Free throw good from Kawhi Leonard. Watching Kawhi enter the league as a lockdown defender and now become an all around champion. Boy, what a career he has had. Good on both. An efficient night from the line. This is a guy who puts in the work and it pays dividends. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. They trail by seven. To the inside, Washington. That shot, no good. Great D that time from Leonard. It's good, and it's his sixth make against 11 attempts. You can see the handle of Kawhi Leonard so much tighter than it used to be. How confident is he off the dribble? Inside. Yep, it goes, and the Clipper lead is cut to just seven on the basket from Gafford. Yeah, the D has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the floor. And here in the second half of play, we're just over a minute in. Here's Jones. And the rejection by Gafford. Doncic with it. 15 points in the game. On the wing, Thompson. Over Harden. And they get it back. Irving kicks to Doncic. Second chance shot. An oh, easy two from Doncic. That nice touch pass right there by Kyrie Irving. That was pretty. The three from Harden buries the long-range jumper. Harden's got 22. Uh, he's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. And I think the defender knows once he gets cooking, look out. The bucket looks awfully big to him right now. And that one's good. Doncic. This has been one of the most elite, consistent scorers since he entered the league. Luka in the house. Passes it to man. Now, here's Zubats. Covered by Gaffer. Again with the block. A, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. Los Angeles leading by six. Harden outside. Pass to man. Leonard on the wing. He's covered by Washington. And Leonard gets it to go. Just incredible touch from the interior. Kawhi Leonard more than capable in that painted area. And the Mavericks call time here. One of the stories here, James Harden getting it done today. 
Well, I think this is a necessary timeout so they can figure out a way to limit the impact this guy's having from three-point range. They've got to dedicate more resources to their perimeter D. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. Eight-point game. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Second Just another foul. day at the office for Mr. Harden. Foul. Once again, making his way to the foul line. In Los Angeles, they have shot 70% from the free throw line tonight. Seven for ten. And the first one at the line is good. James Harden brings tremendous versatility. He can score it. He can distribute. Whatever you need from him offensively, he can provide it. And both free throws good for James Harden. Here's Doncic. 19 points in the game. He kicks to Irving. Five to shoot. The 10 footer finds the target. Irving's got eight. Well, solid work from Kyrie right there. This guy never fears going against bigger players. His shot making too good. Leonard, that's for two. And again, it's the Clippers missing. Mavericks trailed by eight. Irving passes to Doncic. Gafford throws it down. And, and how about the offensive rebound with a little extra punch on the putback? You're right, Greg. As they look to trim the deficit, could we see them send a few more bodies to the boards from here on out? Maybe. Just maybe. Harden inside the three-point line, and he hits the jumper for two. Harden's got 26 points. Well, this is Zubats. He's such a team-first guy. You find an open teammate, put the ball where it needs to be. And Gamble throws it down. And maybe that'll trigger them. Impossible not to get pumped up after that. Yeah, well, you can see the immediate reaction of the guys on the bench. They are pumped up. And stolen by Kyrie Irving. Here's Doncic. Good work defensively by Jones. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. That boy, to have someone back there who can erase your mistakes. What a big-time asset defensively. Here's Leonard again, Los Angeles. Oh, Leonard. Kawhi Leonard right now is cooking, folks. This guy has got a rhythm, and you better watch out. And here is Irving. He's got eight. The pass to Gaffer. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. He's got 12. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. The Clippers again turning it over. Dallas basketball. Mavericks trailed by six. Doncic outside. Irving finds Doncic. Another shot. And it's laid up and in by Washington. Washington's got seven points in the game. And this is something this guy takes pride in. Capitalizing on second chance opportunities. Oh, and James Harden throws it down hard. Wow, James Harden putting a little sauce in the finish. Nicely done. Dallas calls timeout. You gotta like what Harden has done in this game so far. He is on a major roll today. This timeout was desperately needed. They've got to come up with a new game plan designed to shut him down. Mavericks trailed by six. Now, here's Doncic. 
19 points in the game. He gets it in there. Doncic has got 21 in the game. We know that Luka's a three-level scorer. He's elite from any range. That time he goes to the midi. Here's Zubats. Kicks it to Leonard. Fires from deep. And the dunk by Zubats. That gives him the double-double. 10 points and 11 rebounds. That is a product of pure effort, guys. I agree, and that's nothing new coming from him, GA. He loves going to work on the rebounding, going to work on the board. What about the decisive finish? Great timing, tremendous force. And it's Washington missing. Clippers leading by six. Here's Jones. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's his third. Personal it's going to be on Kyrie Irving. Third team foul. Let's look at the energy stats, how the That's hustle game has been Clippers. going for the Clippers. A high effort Junior. brand of defense has been paying off for them in this one. They've managed to either block or alter a ton of their opponent's shots. And the other thing for this team today, they have a bunch of second chance points. They're turning misses into makes. And the first one drops. A big group substitution here for the Clippers. Muhammad Bamba, he's checked in for Zubats. Chris Dunn comes in for Leonard. Powell, he's checked in for Mann. And Kevin Porter's subbed in for James Harden. He's off on the second. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for Dallas. They trail by seven. Here's Doncic. Luka, so skilled. There is this fundamental confidence to what Luka does, and those difficult floaters, no problem. Here's Dunn. It's rebounded by Dallas. Irving's got six rebounds in the game. Doncic outside. Let's it go with a three. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. So for the Clippers, Zubats is checked in for Bamba. Leonard comes in for Jones. And James Harden subbed in for Dunn. Clippers leading by five. Harden the pass to Leonard. Over Kleba. Leonard no luck. A fadeaway, not a terrible idea, but he needs to make the game easier on himself. He's overcomplicating things. Out to the right wing. Porter with the steal. Down low. And Harden with the stop. Oh, my. James Harden with a statement right there. Mavericks trailed by seven. Here's Grimes. Hasn't made one yet. Near the three-point line, it's Doncic. Money from the wing. Quentin Grimes. For Los Angeles, they've gone 8 of 14 on their shot attempts here in the third. Some pretty nice work. Harden the pass to Leonard. Over Kleba. And here is Zubats. Powell kicks to Harden. Six to shoot from way outside and Lively pulls it down a shot like that is a polite way to say hey coach bench me the funny thing is if that doesn't get you benched I have no idea what would and Porter here we go stolen by Thompson pass to Lively that's in, coming off the assist from Thompson. Boy, it doesn't get any easier than that. What a size advantage, and just goes to work. Harden inside the three-point line. It's rebounded by Dallas. Here's Grimes. And the layup's good off the glass. Now just a one-point Clipper lead. Wow, he doesn't make plays like that very often. That's a nice move inside. Zubats, it's good on the putback. Boy, you tell young bigs from the earliest, play strong, finish tough. He beats a Zubats. Nice finish. 
Powell against Doncic. Here's Kleba. Two minutes remaining in the offensive first rebound. Quarter. Mavericks. The second chance effort. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Zubats has got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. Wow. Doncic passes to Kleba. 136 left in the third quarter of the game. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Well, it does a lot of his work on the interior. More than people realize, Clay Thompson gets those calls because of his willingness to put himself in tough spots. The Mavericks have shot 9 of 11 at the free throw line. Free throw good from Thompson. His contemporaries will say this. Clay Thompson's shooting stroke is as pure as it gets. Bomba is checked in for the Clippers. Chris Dunn comes in for James Harden. And Dallas with a change here, too. Dinwiddie is checked in for Luka Doncic. And so Thompson nails both of them. Los Angeles has gone one of three from downtown since halftime. Passes to Leonard. Powell against Thompson. Here's Leonard from out on the wing. He knocks it down. Leonard's got 10 points in the quarter. Wow, pretty pass from Powell. This guy has great instincts as a scorer. That time sets up his teammate. Down against Dinwiddie. There's the drive. Banked in off the glass. This is what we call highly efficient play. Working off the screen, getting to the cup. Dinwiddie with the steal. And here we go. Dinwiddie heading to the hoop. And you talk about fighting your way back into a game. They've shown a lot of grit in this comeback. Yeah, to start off with so many mistakes and still now find a way where everything's working, it allows their momentum and confidence to continue to build. It's good. And the Clippers lead by one. And so it's Dinwiddie with it. He'll bring it up for Dallas. Pass to Grimes. Here's Kleba. And he makes that one. Kleba's got seven. Important points there. Got him on a nice play, getting the ball inside and right to the bucket. Dunn looking over the floor. There's the pass to Leonard. Over Kleba. Again, Los Angeles. We've learned that this guy is capable of connecting from absolutely anywhere. Kawhi simply stated one of the best offensive players in the league. James Harden getting it done for the L.A. Clippers. And his big game just keeps getting bigger. That quarter sees him get over 30 points. Now let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. And he's always been uh, the favorite to bag this honor. These kind of feeds are his bread and butter. Well, this is why great point guard play is so critical in today's NBA. And you see it right there on display. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. So with Harden on the bench, here's who Teron Lewis going with. Chris Dunn is out there with Norman Powell. And there's Mohamed Bamba. And there's Batum. And it's Coffey in at the three seven. And those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. LA's gone outside a lot tonight. 17 times, in fact. 7 of 17. Done against Dinwiddie. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Well, you love the physicality from Chris Dunn. He's willing himself to the stripe thanks to the way he goes straight into the defense on that shot. Two shots.
first free throw is good. Chris Dunn, a complete basketball player, dynamite scorer, remarkable passer, and one of the elite defenders. And that one goes in, two from the line that time. Mavericks trailed by three. Dinwiddie outside to the left side wing beyond the arc Batum grabs the miss rare you'll see him miss such an open look he kicks it to Dunn basket good Chris Dunn. and the Clippers lead by five that's just unreal body control Chris Dunn really showing up the D with that shot here's Exum that one goes in. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. Got to fight over it as a defender. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy. It takes activity. It takes intensity. Here's Dunn. Dinwiddie with some nice D. Mavericks trail by three. Here's Gafford. The shot will not fall. Great D that time from Batum. We're just over a minute and a half now into the fourth. Now here's Poe. He's covered closely. Can't hit from in close. And you know, you can't impact a shot that close any better than he did on that possession. Boy, whether he blocks it or simply alters it, the result is pretty much the same. Dinwiddie finds Gafford. Overdone. Gafford misses. Los Angeles leading by three. Here's Batum. Kleba with the rebound. Kleba's got his fourth rebound in this one. The Mavericks have gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. Daniel yes, Denver. that goes in. Gafford's got ten points in just the second half. I love the tenacity. Terrific move at a crucial point in this game. That is not settling. That is going for a high percentage look at a critical time. Nicely done. And the D not really doing its job there. A little slow to react to the ball getting into the paint. Dallas calls timeout. Zubats is checked in, and then for Dallas, P.J. Washington, he's checked in for Maxi Kleba. Kyrie Irving comes in for Dante Exum, and Luka Doncic subbed in for Dinwiddie. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Hi, Kevin. Well, Jason Kidd going over the plan with his team for the last few minutes. Now, he's not pleased with the perimeter game on both sides of the ball. He told his guys, we aren't working hard enough out there. We need to shut down the perimeter on defense, and on offense, we have to focus from good to great. Guys? All right, thank you, David. And he's able to get it back. And now the fast break. Doncic with the ball. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. The understated part of Luka Doncic's game is strength. He is going to draw contact and usually make it. Luka Doncic shooting two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw good from Doncic. So he gets them both. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Pass to Zubats. At 
the done. Outside Batum. Lays it up off the glass. And the Clippers lead by three. And defense wasn't ready for Batum there. He shakes them off with a clever dribble move. He lobs up the alley -oop pass. Stolen by Zubac. Pass to Batum. Shoots over Washington. Oh, and it's sent back by Washington. Inside. And then Washington with the dunk. Yeah, the court awareness that Luca plays with knows exactly when and where to deliver the pass. Moving against Dunn. And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. When a pick like that is questionable, it creates that much of an advantage for the offense. You have to blow the whistle. I don't think there's any question. There are so many rules that favor the offense these days. You've got to be able to equal things out when an illegal screen is set. Catching up on the changes for the Clippers. Kawhi Leonard, he's checked in for Batum. Mann comes in for Norman Powell, and it's Harden in for Chris Dunn. Here's Doncic. Oh, Doncic in traffic. Boy, at his size, Luka Doncic against a quality contest, able to still finish it. Harden the pass to Zubac. Here's Mann. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. It's on Luka Doncic. In his short career, Terrence Mandoris has been asked to play a variety of positions and roles. And Kevin, that's a testament to his adaptability. He has started. He's come off the bench. One thing we know nightly, he's going to be tremendous with his energy and competitive spirit. And he knocks down the first one. So he picks up just one from the line that time. Mm, that will sting a little bit. Failing to get the lead when the opportunity was there. But he does tie it up. Irving finds Doncic. Now here's Washington. On its way from Irving for two. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Man passes to Harden. Over Thompson. Harden, no good. Boy, a little indecisive. I think he wanted to kick it out, changed his mind, and ended up missing. And two shots coming up at the line as he gets fouled on the shot. Now for P.J. Washington, it's important he continue to establish himself as a lower spacer. This guy can really make threes. Shoot two. Free throw good from Washington. Washington hits them both. Here's Leonard. And the Clippers call time here. You have to like what you're seeing from Luka Doncic. He's just really a one-man wrecking crew down low. And with this timeout, they've got to make some adjustments because he's been steady inside. Harden against Thompson. Harden the best to man. Washington against Leonard. Lock at six. Clippers moving the ball around. And another one in the scoring column for him. He's seven of ten from the field. Yeah, that's Zubac just carving out space with that big frame. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. 
Washington passes to Irving. Here's Zubats, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. Zubats never a guy to shy away from contact. At the line for LA, he beats a Zubats. And he makes the first. What you love about Ivica Zubac is he knows who he is. Big, strong body, mixes it up on the glass, sets solid screens. Just an understanding of who he is. Los Angeles making a switch here. Jones has checked in. And good on the second, so he makes them both. The Mavericks have gone 4 of 10 here in the final period. Not the time to go cold. Irving looking over the floor. Washington finds Thompson. The tray. The rebound by Harden. Harden's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Leonard. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Leonard's got 14 points here in the second half. The toughness and tenacity very much describe Kawhi Leonard's game. Pass to Irving. There's the three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Leonard's got six rebounds here tonight. Outside, Jones. Harden against Thompson. Harden the pass to Leonard. And he banks in the lane. And now a six-point Los Angeles lead. Well, with a seven-foot-three wingspan, Kawhi Leonard can beat even good defense with that reach. Doncic against Jones. Chalk up two there. Doncic has got six points in the quarter. Uh, and that was the right call. When, when you need a basket, go to the guys you trust the most. Well, you've got to earn trust and equity by making shots. Nice delivery there. Here's Washington, and it's sent back by Leonard. Oh, Kawhi oh, Leonard, the claw says, not here, not now. And so here is Dallas, trailing by four. Now Jones. Harden outside. With the shot. And it's Kyrie Irving with the rebound. Irving's got seven rebounds in the game. Off target from outside. It's almost like he's trying to make things hard on himself. You know, he's just got to slow the game down, try to get some easy ones. They've been leaning on Ibiza Zubats offensively all night, and he has answered the call. Jones against Doncic. And the pass to Irving. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got six assists now in the game. Clippers leading by three. Leonard with the ball. Pass to Mann. Jacks up a three. Buries it from three-point range. Mann's got four points this quarter. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Doncic dishes to Thompson. Outside Irving. Six on the shot clock. Fires the three. Another three for Dallas. Huge bucket from Kyrie. Knows how to deliver. Los Angeles has gone one and two from three-point range here in the fourth. Leonard against Washington. Top of the key. And it's Leonard missing. Mavericks trailed by three. 
here is Doncic. To tie it up. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Mann's got his fourth rebound in this one. And he slams it one-handed. And he just bangs down the one-handed. Mm -hmm. Two very easy points right here. Dallas calls timeout. It's DJ time, fans. Who wants one? Come on, let's hear it. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Ivica Zubac. And he's just been crushing it from the field tonight, Kevin. Whether it's been on open looks or with the guy draped all over him, he just hadn't missed much. With his percentage in the sky-high range, they've had no choice but to make him their number one option on every trip. Here's Doncic. To the inside. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. There is an imagination of creativity. This guy's passing drives the offense. Leonard, no luck. Boy, he'll usually knock it down if he's left that wide open. Just comes up empty. To the paint. Stolen by Harden. Passes it to Mann. And it's good off the back of the rim. And in. This is where James Harden's ability to quickly scan the floor and then find the right window to deliver the pass. So good. So good. To the middle. Stolen by Zubac. Feeds it to Lenny. And that one, good. Now it's a seven-point clipper lead. And no surprise here, right? This guy is not only a gifted player, but he is so smart on the offensive end. Here's Lively. Nails the close-range fadeaway jump. Boy, there is an artistry and a feel to Luka Doncic's game. This guy is elite with his playmaking. Leonard inside. He's covered by Washington. And Leonard gets it to go. Leonard's got 32 points. Well, everyone's seeking those high percentage looks in the restricted area. Nicely done there. Washington against Zubac. Harden kicks to Leonard. Pass to Mann. And there's the pass to Zubac. Four on the shot clock. This one for three. And they recover it. Wow, just getting all Members the luck basketball. right now, it seems. Good bounce. Dallas calls timeout. They're down by seven. 19 seconds left in the fourth. What do you think, guys? And a little late to implement a plan B. This game is a wrap. Well, I think he might just want to remind these guys, hey, let's finish the game the right way. Thompson against Harden. Thompson misses. Harden outside. So the Clippers with the win. Probably a little closer than they would have liked it, but a win nonetheless. Yeah, but I really got a sense that the fans gave them that emotional boost that was needed down the stretch. This crowd, man, they were electric. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much. Kawhi, how satisfied are you with your team's performance tonight in this win? Well, we did a great job tonight. You know, we got to come in every game with the defensive hat on first, and we did that tonight. We made shots, and we, we ended up winning the game. You took it to them when it mattered, man. Congrats on the win.